shouldn't do the sound effect. <laughs> you smell like urine. <laughs> I would fire you if you weren't so goddamn beautiful out there. The metals may be heavy, but <laughs> what the f are our lines? So much wardrobe, so little acting. These words are impossible These words to are remember. This like Chinese to me. Can he be in Walderberg? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is just gross. Oh, I got a pit. Oh. You got any tats? <laughs> Look what I brought. Oh. It's gonna take more than that. <laughs> Even the magic of Gladril. <laughs> From some chicken. I said chicken, not zucchini. Oh, I don't take it. I think it's done. I think it's done. Woo! Woo! Scott Hamilton! Hey, Nancy. After all this, I'd very much enjoy laying you down and eating a rack of baby back ribs off your rack, baby. And that's just a foreplay. I hate working for you. You signed a contract. Guess what? I took a dump on that contract and I FedExed it to your house. I doubt it. I doubt you did that. I can give you the tracking number. I want to shave your head <laughs> and eat your hair like spaghetti. Like put sauce on it. I want to sleep in your ear. <laughs> Do you want your eyebrows? I want to chew on your teeth. <laughs> We're skating to one song, one song only. Limp Biscuit. I did it all for the nookie. Come on, the nookie. Come on. And you can take your cookie and stick it up your what? Stick it no, up your what? No, absolutely not. Are you listening to this? It's going to be great. One song, one song only. Let it skin her do that smell. Ooh, that smell. Can't you smell that smell? Absolutely. Ooh. Your push ups, I'll do mine. You like what you see? Now, Strom's Gary, Indiana, is still expecting an apology from 2002. Are they going to get one? The people of Gary, Indiana can rot in hell as okay, far as Strons. I can... Okay, everyone can relate to the fact that children don't start wars. Adults do. Oh, yes, yeah, true. Children. Some children, though, are made in test tubes. People. No, I said coaches are for ugly people. But it was quiet. How could they have known that I farted? Think about and our skate fans. your tits off, you know? <laughs> I looked at Jimmy, I said, this is the moment. We got to skate our tits off. Scott! <laughs> We're going to Montreal! What do you guys have that none of the other teams have? Okay. Two baloney ponies? Matching junk? Two cock-a-doodle-doos? Matching sets of crotch luggage? Same groin goodies? Nothing breaks up a team faster than jealousy. Unwanted pregnancy. Jealousy. Erectile dysfunction. Third person in the bedroom. You said is good for us. I don't know why. Another dude. Until her friend, massage therapist named Dawn, 
walked in the room naked with a bottle of canola oil and a trained uh, monkey who knew how to operate a video camera, a Bengal tiger, and four members of Cirque du Soleil, a trident and a net, and a woman who said she was her grandmother, and a German shepherd named Larry. Nothing was going on except friendship between my hands and some boobs. One word and one number. That word, commitment. And that number, a thousand percent. Commitment to our friendship, that's why I'm calling you. And if that was an anagram, it would be Kotov. Committed to our friend, Kotov. Kotov, buddy, call me back. Here's the thing that I've always wanted to say. You smell really nice. You do. Well, you smell like different things. Some days you smell like lilacs. Other days you have kind of a rich musk, rich dark wood mixed with leather. I dig your smell. Okay, d face. I've had it with you and your perfect hair and your goody goody ivory soap bullshit. And hey, newsflash teeth are not supposed to be that white, okay? It's just plain creepy. Are you trying to look like Glenn Close from Fatal Attraction? Because kudos to you. You are pulling off that look. You are nailing it. Look, I just thought of something really important, so call me back. I mean, I love your outgoing message. Every time I hear it, I find a little extra layer to it. Jimmy, we are riding on the roller coaster of friendship. <laughs>